Welcome to a demonstration of NetSuite Quality Management. In this video, we will see how it is used on the shop floor. I am logged in as a quality engineer or inspector. My primary dashboard is the specification queue that drives my daily activity. The queue offers a filter, which allows me to ensure I'm at the right location. The settings are flexible allowing me to personalize my queue depending on my area assignment, whether in receiving or in production. The date created column highlights how long items have been waiting for inspection. Let's take a look at work order 698, which was completed a few minutes ago. This specification includes four inspection elements. Blend checks inspects for product compliance. I am instructed to take two samples. You see that my sampling grid opens for the necessary tests. Field help exposes additional instructions and the item specific target range for each item I am reviewing. As I record the results, the entry fields will change color based on the specific field validation. I update my summary fields, which drive an inspection validation. In this case, everything passed successfully and the bar turns green. Had the inspection failed, the bar would have turned red. My next inspection is blender settings which helps in controlling the process and capturing data for continuous improvement. I can also use a free text box to record any observations that may help improve the process. In this case, I want to note consistent mix and color. Finally, there's also an option to take a photo to help clarify what I'm seeing. When I select Finish Inspection, you'll notice that it is removed from my screen so I can focus on what's next. Results are immediately available on various reports such as a vendor scorecard or inspection detail throughout the plant. 